Department will be an international gathering, delivering the necessary tools and information to anyone wanting to host their own DDPs or get involved in the party revolution. It will feature party workshops, adventures, and if all goes according to plan, climax in a massive DDP featuring seven different toms, seven different transmitters, and be broadcast live across Canada. This simultaneous Canada-wide party will also be the climactic final scene required to complete our documentary film. For seven long years, I've dedicated my life to this project, risked physical and financial ruin and massive liability. Kept going after losing six different toms and never said die. I did this because I believe in becoming the change you want to see, and I am absolutely convinced that capital P partying properly applied is a force more powerful than all others combined. As Martin Luther King Jr. said, those who love peace must learn to organize as effectively as those who love war. Rather than a common adversary, capital P partying represents a common goal, an explosion of collaborative creativity that is 100% inclusive and 100% capable of mobilizing billions around the world in peaceful celebration. It's creation versus destruction at its finest, and our last, best hope to unite the world and party into a bold new paradigm that will maximize freedom, creation, and loving connection. All it needs is your support to keep going. And so, we've set up this Patreon fundraising page in hopes that those who believe in our unique movement and message will help us to keep the dream alive. Patreon is like subscription crowdfunding where instead of a single large goal, patrons pledge small, ongoing amounts to people whose work they value and want to see continue. While hundreds of people believe in the party revolution and are glad to volunteer their spare time, we do require a small, dedicated team to coordinate the volunteers, lay the foundation for the DDP.network community, and ultimately, make the DDP self-sustainable. With the DDP Summit only five months away, this is a crucial crunch time for us and every dollar counts. Even two dollars a month would make a massive difference. Visit patreon.com slash DDP for more information. Thank you for supporting the party revolution. So that is a quick overview of what we've been up to and trying to crowdfund for the last seven years. And it's been a difficult journey to say the least, but it's been amazing to use crowdfunding and we've turned, I don't know how many people on to the idea of crowdfunding and the possibility of being able to use it to fund weird new adventures. Like there's no way we could have done this unless we teamed up with a corporate sponsor, which is actually kind of impossible because when we do these parties, we never get permits or permission, and there's obviously gigantic liability issues, so it would be impossible to do this as an awesome, freewheeling, spontaneous thing without crowdfunding. So very glad all these technologies have come along at just the right time. And I would be glad to answer any questions anyone had about this project or our experience. And that's it. Thanks for coming out. Any questions? When is the event happening in August? It's this year, right? Um, that video we actually created last year. And it did happen, but we might be doing another one. We've been talking with CBC about potentially teaming up to do a Canada-wide party, like where our signal would go to them, and then they'd broadcast out everywhere in Canada, and anyone that had a radio could tune in. And we have an app, DDP Party app, where people can press the party button, and then you can see anyone around you that wants to party. So it's a way to have a city-wide party where people can tune in their car stereos, home stereos, boom boxes. So we have been chatting with them. It doesn't look like it is going to work out for Canada Day, July 1st, but hopefully sometime in the future. They want us to look into insurance, so we've been doing that. 
is seeing whether that might actually be possible to acquire. But uh, yeah, I can give you a card for the DDP website. If you're on the mailing list, then you'll never miss one. And Facebook group as well. So how many people do you have helping you to crown fund these uh, for each of the events? And you know, you, you mentioned that you, uh, your greatest success was when you were having 30 or 40 crowdfunding campaigns instead of just the one. How come you went back to the one instead of continuing on with the multiples and then choosing which one was more successful, which team was more successful in getting the party up and running? Well, the evolution of this thing is pretty complicated. So the idea after the American tours was we would create a documentary film, which we also crowdfunded a bunch of money to do. And while we were working on that, this opportunity to do the European tour came up at the last minute. So it was just a super last minute thing. And how much leeway do you have for each of the crowdfunding campaigns that you do? I'm asking specific business questions. What do you mean by you? Uh, um, so when you're starting a crowdfunding campaign for a party area, uh, how, what's your lead up time before the party happens? Or is it just spontaneous and it just happens? Ideally, we have a lot of lead up time, but All right. in practice, it's always pretty crazy so okay. far. All right. Um, okay. Thank you. Yeah. And we do have, uh, it wasn't mentioned in here, time restraints, but... Our goal for doing the world tour once the documentary is released is back in the day, governments used to sell war bonds to raise money to fight a war, World War I, World War II. So we wanted to kind of turn that notion on its head and sell a million dollars worth of peace bonds to do our world tour yeah. and uh, in promotion of world peace. And then once that was achieved and we'd won the Nobel Prize, everyone would be paid back. And during our Nobel Prize acceptance speech, the idea is to just propose the idea that every country of the world spend half their defense budget for the next year on partying instead of killing people. And we figure once that was done, we'd win the Nobel Prize a second time, so everyone would double their money just like that. So that's the next stage, but first we have to get this documentary done. And I have some Patreon cards over there if anyone would like to support the cause. And that's about it for today. Awesome. Thanks for coming out. And thank you for supporting us, everyone who has. Thank you.